everyone, welcome to a new video. Today's topic is... Who? Wait, wait. Who? Mate. Dead step. Was there a single person or were there many, many hands? Well, we'll see. Uh, I'm talking about the entire topic as if it's a, it's a mystery. It's not. A little bit it is, I guess. First thing we gotta look at is what do people already know about dead step? To investigate the matter, I did what I do went and asked producers who they think made the genre and surprisingly the answers were very very different look at how many people said Bratkela crazy right so that's our number one candidate so who else we have a moth okay a moth also is pretty prominent look at this but comparatively much less than Bratkela okay our second contestant or second name is Moth. The first obvious choice for us to solve this mystery would be to first go to Moth. What does he think about who made it? And Moth thinks Bratkila made it. So, okay, now we've come to Bratkila again. What can we do? Let's go ask him. Why not? Let's go ask him. So, I went to Facebook. I sent him a message stating that, hello, Mr. Bratkila, whatever, whatever. I explained what I'm doing and he actually wrote me back how nice of him respect huge respect so he told me a thing that was pretty curious and you know what that thing was that thing was this if you look at Bratkila's answer to that he said not him substep infrabase I've not heard of this before who is substep infrabase do you know anything about it well, a couple people do know. For example, I've written SI in a couple of places. See, influx new, as in new, TV even new. I think there was another person, punishment knew it. So yeah, there were people who knew it, but they were not too sure about the fact. Again, lack of documentation. You know what Bratkila did? Not only did he answer my questions, he also connected me through Substep Infrabase, yes. The first piece of information I came across was this article he wrote in 2016, and this discusses the term dead step. This is probably the only piece of information you will find on the internet that is from the legit producers and not from a third party. So at least that's what I've come across. The crux of this entire article is that the term was first heard by Brad Kila in 2007 or 2008. This is not an exact date, it's a rough estimate. And it was actually from the producer, Substep Infobase. After that, Brad Kila decided to make his own stuff because whatever Substep Infobase was making, that sure had the ambience wasn't as heavy as Bratkila would prefer. He was a metalhead and being a metalhead you want everything heavy you know. <laughs> so he worked on the sounds, created what he created and released the Dead Step LP and that's how the genre was established officially. So that's the story. Now rest of it I will not read. I will leave the link in the description. You can go ahead and read that if you would like. But again, do remember this one point, that a genre is not created by one person. Sure, there is a pioneer that creates the genre and coins the name, does the first experiments, but to make it into something that Death Step is today, it requires the contributions from many, many people. And Substep Infrabase, let's call him the grandfather of Death Step, and let's say Bratkila was the father. But along with Bratkila, there were many other producers who could be considered as godfathers. Because, sure, Bratkila released the first LP, but after he released that, there were so many producers who jumped on the bandwagon and started making their own sounds, made it heavier and heavier, and I'm glad they did. A couple names that I know, because I don't know all the names, and I apologize anyone who I've missed I'm really sorry it's not because I intentionally wanted to it's just because I don't know all of the names so some of the names that are the godfathers are moth atomize 
Haxim, Kraton, Venom, Osiris, or oh, that got a little wonky, never mind that. Osiris, Ram, Dieselcraft, 1.8.7, Death Death, Mantis, a couple other people. So there you have it. Who made Death Step? Grandpa Rob, aka Substep Infrabase. Then you have Father Baratkila, and then you have Godfathers. And when it was made? Well, it was made officially with the Death Step LP, but before that, it was conceptualized in 2007-2008. So there you have it. Now you know when and who made it. Want to know anything else or want to know more about Substep Infrabase and Bratkila's interviews? Be sure to subscribe to the channel so that you know when I announce the release of the book that I'm writing that talks in detail, a lot of details about what happened behind the scenes, what inspired them, what kind of struggles they had releasing this. If you are into all that kind of stuff, be sure to check it out. And until next time, bye bye.